Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna go through rigging the new Holt Production swim minnow and a few techniques on how to fish them when you're out in the water. So there's a heap of different ways you can rig the swim minnow. Jig head, weedless, weightless, and we've got our own that suits the profile of the head perfectly. So I'll show you how to rig the swim minnow on our jig head. Straight in through the nose, out the back, and due to the really thin profile of this lure, it's best to put a little bit of spit on the keeper and it stops the head bunching up. And that's how you want it to sit like that. So there's a heap of different weedless hooks that suit them. I like to use these twist locks in the PVC. Twist him on. In through the belly. Out of the hook slot. There's a couple of techniques that I use for the swim minnow and it depends on what species you're chasing. So if you're chasing your pelagic estuary fish, like all your trevally species, the main thing is you want to be hitting the bottom, five or six small hops up and letting it hit the bottom again. And what you're essentially doing is getting it high up into the water column and then letting it sit back down hitting the bottom. And if you're chasing your dewfish, flathead, anything like that, I like to do two small hops up and then letting it hit the, mod, hit the bottom again and not winding too much line between your hops. I think the most important thing with any soft plastics fishing is keeping it simple. As long as you're making contact with the bottom consistently, you can't go wrong. Like, wait a second. Yep. So that's all of the basics you need to know about the swim minnow and how to use it and how to rig it. If you want more information on it, it will be on the website and the socials.